everyone, I hope this show finds you well. Welcome to this special edition of the Brandon Dilworth Show. This is the best of BDS. Deuces 2020! The original title for this special was Deuces 2020! I hope I never had to see your MF face again! But the title was too long and it also included some profane language. We're going to take a look at some of the best moments since I brought back this show this year. But before we do all that, since this is kind of our wind down show, I just want to remind George of something. You know, you got wrapping presents, check. Putting up the tree or trees, check. Making sure that your online packages are on time and they arrive before Christmas. That's a major check. But you know what's also a major check? Voting. And let me just show you how to get that done. Uh, Georgia, y'all thought y'all were done? Psych! Because it's a runoff time. You can request an absentee ballot. Like the one I have right here, it's almost complete. I didn't put my address on there because there's one thing that I hate more than internet trolls, it's stalkers. Another route you can take is early voting, which has actually started. And we'll conclude on a day we're all looking forward to. That's New Year's Day, January the 1st. The last day to vote is on the day of the runoff elections, January the 5th. So get out or stay home. Don't really matter. Just vote. Make voting a part of your holiday plans. And don't be crying if you don't. And now that I've let everybody know about voting, I want to give a brief backstory on the show uh, for those that are new. So from 2016 to 2017, I used to do this show back in the old format, you know. Of course I had memes. Of course I had videos. I also had news too, mainly wrestling. And two reasons that I stopped uh, doing this show uh, three years ago. One, I was not feeling good about the content that I was producing on this show. Two, the college work that I had was piling up and basically I had to just plan for the future. Fast forward to 2020. I thought about doing this show again. I thought about finishing the show on my terms and uh, without warning, the pandemic let in. The pandemic, if you know what I mean. And as a result, bringing back this show suddenly couldn't wait any longer. It feels good to uh, do this show once again in, in a better format. And you can catch all the uh, BDS episodes. If that's what you want to do, I've arranged a playlist on those. So uh, check them out. It will be on the cars and the end screen as always. So ever since this show started back up, I decided to uh, offer up my little two cents on topics that I thought need to be discussed. All while keeping them in a humorous and fun way. Take a look at some of my best sense. Everybody should have a lot of time in their hands. After all, we're on lockdown, or most of us should be. I'm reminded of the fact that America is really getting stupider by the day. Those premium mannequins came from a supplier that manufactures sex toys. Yeah, uh, that escalated quickly. If you are an Atlanta Falcons fan. Oh my God, no, no! It is time for you to damage your mental health as much as you can. No, 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 no. Just because you want to see them win. What a crazy period of months leading to the election. Look at young Brandon. He just wants to live his life. I can't do it. I'm about to put up on here. I'm a vote for Trump. And that's what you get for voting for a reality star. <laughs> do you talk? Do you breathe? And do you drink water? Wear a goddamn mask. Wear a mask. Please wear a mask. Wear a mask. Don't be a moron. Ah, uh, look at smart, sensible me. Now, part of the reason why I loved doing this version of the show, the skits. Take a look at all the best times when I was with the skits. Oh my gosh. Him again? Uh, okay, Mr. President, is there any update to this TikTok situation? Is it going to be? Is it going to be? 
Basically, Kamala, Mala, Kabala, Kabala, Mala, 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 Mala. Mute, 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 mute. Why isn't this working? Omaha, Omaha. Nah, it's when me. Bada, la, 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 la. You just have to salvage with what Sandy you have left. America always does. Yeah, sure, the power button works. And now, I don't mean to brag, but I would argue that my shows from 16 and 17, some of them could be used for memes. Heck, you could use them for memes too. Give me credit though. Maybe I would like to create some more. Let's take a look at this year's meme worthy moments. I know this is gonna um, bite me the behind later on, but um, did a little trimming with my hair. Sorry, mom. I fear that those people they're gonna mess with my drink. I love that blue muffin. We'll buy it as is. They ripped my heart out. We'll buy it as is. This time around, I guess I'm sensitive. Uh, we'll buy it as is. Hell hath no fury. Let's make this state even more mediocre and stupid than it's ever been. Like a woman fed up with your gaming addiction. Blind leading blind, or better term, ignorant leading ignorant. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. And Lamont once said, almost everything will work again if you unplug it for a few minutes, including you. That seems accurate today as more so this year than years past, we have been glued to our screens. But what are the responsibilities? What are the worries and concerns on those screens and beyond? Were you down? Well, it's simple. Turn it off. Take a break. Look at the people and the things that make your life just a little bit easier. Then, once you're fully recharged, you can tackle on those challenges head on with confidence. It's okay to pursue the life that you want. Just make sure that you live and appreciate the life that you have today. Ladies and gentlemen, that is it for this episode and that is it for this show in 2020. It has been rough for all of us, you know. I believe 2021 will be so much better. I love entertaining y'all. And uh, I hope that you have enjoyed this content as much as I have making it. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for uh, supporting me. Um, yeah, I really do appreciate it, you know, for all the breaks, for all the crap that uh, I've had to deal with. Uh, truly means the world that people still watch the show, people still watching my videos. Uh, I really do appreciate it. So thank you very much. And I look forward to doing this show again in 2021. So I hope to see y'all there. Love y'all. God bless. And until we meet again, don't forget to love yourself and one another. See you next time.